Let's do another one now. This time the other side. This GPU here. I think it's the GPU. So preheat plate. I don't even think we need a preheat plate, eh? No. Because we're just gonna come with the heat. Alright, let's just do it. Um, what do we got? We got that, we got lighting, and we're not going to use any suction tool that's making a little in the background. We're just going to use this guy, just like that, top, take care. And so simply put some flux. Maybe the preheat would be good to use in the production for the real job where we don't want to do any damage to any components but in this case we're just going to for the fun of it give it a go okay okay let's do its magic This is 400 degrees. Let's try it on the chip. Oh, thank you. Put it on the table for me. Thank you. Have a good day. Yeah, I'll explain the problem with this method shortly. Let's increase the temperature. 450. Yeah, no, just stay on the side. Mmm, yeah. So to, 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 to watch in, in the TV? Yeah, so I can watch back and remember how I did it, what mistakes I made. So I'm currently training, I'm learning at the moment. Because I also need to learn. Do you like to learn new things? No. Oh really you do? No. If you don't learn new things, how are you gonna do new things? <laughs> Something popped, okay. Wow, okay. Did you hear that popping sound? So this puts a lot of stress on this board. Oh, here we go, more popping here. Yeah. So this is bad. This is not the right way to do this job. Yeah. So the motherboard is actually warping a little bit. You know what warping means, Anna? Changing shape. And these caps should be all melting. Yeah, yeah. there we go. Get a popcorn sound here. Yeah. Alright, this is a complete fail. This motherboard will actually be in a worse condition now. So I'm just gonna yank it up because this is a fail. Okay. Hey no. What? I found the lizard. You found the lizard? Come, come. 
where I'm coming. Okay, the reason why this is a fail, the motherboard, I think it's actually warped. You can see this discoloration. Mm, how can I show you? There's actually a discoloration on the board due to excess heat. So, and if you can see, the board is actually slightly concave. It's actually bent a little bit. So it's, uh, it's actually going up like this a little bit due to excess heat. So this is bad. It's a bad way to remove a chip. So preheater is a must and coming at lower temperatures to remove the chip. We'll give it another go shortly. But that's the issue. Alright, and we heard some popping sounds here and there. Yeah, not good. Alright, see you in the next one.